Hi, this is Steve Knight and welcome to Blackwell Global's Daily Market Update. Starting with the Euro on Friday's session was relatively positive for the pair as the US core retail sales and consumer sentiment figures proved disappointing coming in at 0.2% and 98.1% respectively. Subsequently the pair rose above the 50 EMA to close the session up around the 1 spot 0621 mark. Moving forward, market liquidity is currently relatively thin, but keep a watch for the upcoming EU trade balance figures. Turning to the cable now, and the pair remains beset by the continuing Brexit negotiations, with the latest volley of shots from the UK suggesting that they may seek to introduce tax regulations that could be seen as a tax haven if the EU fails to deal on immigration provisions. Subsequently, the rhetoric is heating up and it's highly likely that we will see volatility in the week ahead as further negotiations ensue. Finally, turning to the Australian dollar and the pair continued to rise throughout Friday's session as it benefited from the broadly weaker US dollar. Much of the drive was fueled by the surprisingly disappointing US economic data which saw the Aussie closing the week around the spot 7499 mark. Moving forward, keep a watch on the Australian home loan figures due out shortly and forecast at 0.9%. Well that's all I've got for you today, this is Steve Knight with Blackwell Global, thanks for watching.